New at 10 and only on Way 31, SWAT instructors from all across Alabama gathered in Morgan County this week to master some life-saving tactics from a seasoned professional. Way 31 reporter Julia Miller gives us a close look at the intense training. Over the past 40 hours, SWAT men from all across Alabama have been training in this facility behind me. Their goal, to gain new skills to bring back to their community with the help of one professional. Listen for it. What you just saw was a demonstration of a special operations hostage rescue hosted by Aaron Cohen, an Israeli special operations veteran. What he teaches is the behavioral based tactic designed by Israelis to combat terrorism. He says the priority is to minimize the risk to innocent bystanders at the same time. These special operations units or these SWAT teams need to have a very specific type of training that's going to be congruent to what it's going to look like. Cohen says the training helps show how your body reacts during a life or death situation. That means you can prepare yourself ahead of time and learn how to focus on the target. They looked at how the body responded when being fired at under stress, and built and harnessed a tactical doctrine around that system, and that's what I teach. He says this training is something he hopes other law enforcement agencies will pick up. I think what you're seeing here is a paradigm shift. And I think this is going to go national and every SWAT team is going to be training in these tactics. Cohen says he hopes his training will be bridge building between the community and law enforcement. It's time to rebridge that gap between law enforcement and communities. These aren't your enemies, man. These are the lifesavers. These are the ones who come into your schools and rescue you. For more on this story, check out our website, waytv.com. Reporting in Morgan County with coverage you can count on, Julia Miller, Way 31 News.